In a few days, I'll be turning 26 years old. While thinking what have I achieved during my 20s so far, I made a list of 10 essential skills that everyone should know by their mid-20s. On today's video, I'm gonna be teaching you five of those skills that I think every adult should master in, let's say, their first five years of your adult life. If you wait till the end, you'll even see maybe a six bonus. I don't know. Spoiler alert. Time management. Time management is probably one of the most essential skills to learn by the age of 20. You must learn how to schedule your time and manage it appropriately while doing your personal projects and job. If you can manage your time effectively, you'll not only succeed in life, but you'll have more time to do the things that you like, the things you enjoy. So by the age of 25, you should master this skill and perhaps not master it, but get close to mastering it and know how to manage your time effectively being able to have fun, work, side hustle perhaps, do sports, be healthy. If you can manage your time effectively, your life will come easier. You will find a lot of time at your disposal to do a lot of the things you like. Skill number two is learning to cook. I mean, who doesn't like food? By the age of 25, if you can afford it, you will want to start looking into the idea of moving out of your house, if you haven't done so, of course. By the age of 25, you will also need to learn how to cook. I mean, you won't depend your whole life of deliveries or your mom's food, right? Some people do stay and do live off their mom's food, but that's a side note. So in order to live by yourself, you need to learn to cook. You won't want to order all your whole life uh, delivery. You get fat, you unhealthy, you don't know what it's made of and it's expensive. So if you live by yourself, you will want to learn to cook and you will want to surprise your friends, your family, when they come to have a drink, when they come to have a dinner at your place, especially. Yeah, that makes sense, right? Not a drink. <laughs> I think it's dinner, yeah. The older you get, the more you will be wanting to try new flavors, new cuisine, new food. The more older you get, the less uh, outdoor activities you'll be doing and you will want to feel, stay in the comfort of your house, cooking a delicious dish, surprising your friends, family, kids, etc. I mean, you won't want your kids to eat unhealthy food all the rest of your life, right? Like, what are you gonna teach your kids in 18 years when they ask you, hey, dad, can you make me rice? And the rice burns. No, we don't want that, right? Time management goes hand in hand with punctuality. I mean, if you're able to manage your time effectively, you'll be able to be punctual in time. Know how to get from A to B. This is another skill to master. Punctuality is the ability to prompt, attend appointments on time and submit your assignments by the deadline. In a professional environment, being punctual involves planning ahead and making arrangements to ensure that you can fulfill your obligations on a strict schedule. This includes coordinating your commute to arrive at work and start your shift at a designated time. Getting a schedule to attend meetings and planning your work to finish your duties when your manager or client needs them to be complete in time. When it comes to school, punctuality is taught on a day-to-day -day basis. I mean, didn't it happen that you would arrive late, maybe once, twice, and your teacher would be mad. She was teaching you punctuality. So by the age of 25, you need to know how to be punctual, how to be on time. Budgeting is item number four on the list. You start working full time. You start getting more money. You start getting the most money you've ever gotten in your life up until now. Yourself earning a lot of money makes it you want to spend it. You want to buy the latest iPhone. You want to buy a new computer. You want to buy the latest piece of clothes. I get it. It's fine and nice. Budgeting is important because it allows you to control your spending, track your budget, invest eventually. Additionally, it can help you to make better financial decisions when you want to buy a house, you want to buy a car, make an investment, you will also be prepared for emergencies and you will stay focused on your long-term goals. Everyone has that one friend that never replied to text, that never checks their phone, that never know about the social gatherings, when your friends are getting together, where you're going, where, how. Yeah, he's just a mess, no offense taken, and you know who I'm talking about. I get it, it can be difficult to get organized, to get your shit together, it can be tricky. But by the age of 25, you should master this skill. You should be able to have an inventory of the things that you need to do, when, where, what. Being organized will allow you to be more on time. Having a clear understanding where you need to be, when you need to be, will make you more punctual and more likely succeed in your work and life in general. 
I have my dog just staring at me. Hey, Queenie! Hi! Hi! <laughs> if you made it this far in the video, you made it to the bonus tip. Learn how to do your taxes. I was lucky enough to have one friend that taught me how to do my taxes. I didn't know that I could, for example, get my tuition fee deducted out of my tax rates. Every year, at the end of the year, if I paid it myself, here in the Netherlands, I could put my tuition fee of 2,000 euros, tax deduction, and I would get it back in income. Yes, 2,000 euros, you heard right, Americans. 2,000 euros, euros, euros.